Hello folks, welcome back to Florida Food Forest. Here is a cool plant, definitely for sure worth growing. Last Two years ago we got hit by 27 degrees, it did just fine. This year it got hit by 23 and did just fine. Might have slowed it down a little bit, but it's just fine. Not a problem at all. So I added a whole bunch more. I think there's 15 of them now I got growing. I uh, ordered a whole bunch of seeds from Tradewinds Fruits, and as this video is being uploaded, they're still available on Tradewind Fruits uh, page there. I'm yet to have any other fruit. I've heard it explained kind of like a watery mango to an apricot, but I've also heard them get explained pretty gnarly like a garlic type flavor. I'm not afraid of that. I mean, I like durian. Uh, that's kind of a funky fruit, um, but I also have a garcinia that's kind of garlic tasting. I got this one from Tradewinds Fruits two years ago. And when the new leaves come out, they have a velvet flavor. <laughs> yeah, the leaves taste like velvet. <laughs> the leaves, when they come out, they feel kind of velvety. As I age, I lose that, uh, that velvet feeling. I understand they can get about 24 foot tall. That's not going to happen with this. I'll keep it about 12 foot tall. That way I can harvest the fruits and get all those yum-yums in my tum-tum. They don't seem to be bothered by pests much, though something is much on the leaves, the plant will be just fine with that. And here's the seeds. They've only been in here for about two weeks, and they are erupting out. I'm really excited about these. I will cover this plant on the channel here. If you uh, have any feedback, please let me know down in the comment section. I would definitely appreciate it. Other than that, I appreciate you watching. Have an awesome day. Chester bird. Chirper. Chirper. <laughs>